pain theories. Pain is an inevitable part of our lives and we like to understand the theories of pain. They have greatly evolved in the last few years and have been recently upgraded. Let's go back to the 17th century when the scientists would cut open a dead body to understand pain. Those were also the days when psychology was yet to be discovered and was termed as hocus pocus. The first theory of pain was the specificity theory given by René Descartes. The pathway was very simple based on anatomy stating that the pain follows a straight pathway to the brain or it was also called as the direct line projection theory. Injury activates the pain receptors and the sensation is transmitted to the brain via spinal cord. Pain experience was proportional to the injury and damage caused. Now this was a theory which was accepted for three centuries up till 1950s. The drawback was that this theory was very simplistic and did not take into account any psychological factors caused uh, uh, related to the pain. Several attempts were made to upgrade this theory. Pattern theory did emerge which attempted to put the role uh, of the dorsal root ganglion in the spinal cord uh, for pain pathway mode away from and it shifted it away from the periphery and therefore paved the way to the pain gate theory.